In 2022 coverage, we're looking at important issues in Pennsylvania this election season. And tonight, the focus is on abortion. News ace Barbara Barr is covering the Senate race and shows us what the candidates and voters are saying about the issue. Opponents and supporters of abortion rights took to the Capitol steps this week, voicing their opinions to Pennsylvania lawmakers. The Supreme Court decision overturning a woman's right to an abortion, giving power back to the states, highlighted this controversial issue and the role it could play in the outcome of the Pennsylvania Senate race. The biggest thing for me is the abortion thing that's going on right now. We talk with voters at Penn Square in Lancaster. What issues are important to you in this upcoming election? Climate change is always number one, um, but uh, protecting women's access to abortion. Taxes are a concern for me. And a suburban park about the topics that could impact the way they vote in November. Mainly the economy. Education um, and health care. A number of issues were mentioned, but abortion rights came up repeatedly. Opinions are strong and divided. Abortion, it should be done away with. It should be done away with because you're taking lives. I don't think it's right for people to get in the way of what doctors and patients need to decide. Democrats are counting on the Supreme Court's ruling overturning Roe v. Wade to drive up turnout, offsetting Republican emphasis on the economy, crime, and the southern border. Pre-Dobbs, Republicans had a big advantage in the number of their voters who said they were very interested in voting come November. In our August poll, that changed markedly. Still, the Franklin and Marshall polls showed social issues, including abortion, fall well below the economy in terms of importance to Pennsylvania voters. You believe in exceptions? I've asked the Senate candidates in one-on-one -on -one interviews where they stand. I believe in exceptions, which I've talked about quite a bit in the primary, which are the, the safety of the mother, the life of the mother, uh, and rape and incest. And in my heart as a, as a doctor, I understand the challenges of being in that situation, and I would allow abortion in those cases. Do you believe there should be any restrictions on abortion? I, I don't. I believe that's a choice between a woman and her doctor. You know, as a politician and a man, I don't have any input in that. Both candidates address the issue on their websites. On Senator Lindsey Graham's proposal to ban abortion after 15 weeks, an Oz spokesperson tells me while Dr. Oz is pro-life, as senator he'd want to make sure that the federal government is not involved in interfering with the state's decision on the topic. Our next issue will address voter concerns about the economy and how the candidates would improve it. Barbara Barr, WGAL News 8.